The Nexus 6P is Google's second stab at a phablet. While the Nexus 6 was too bulky for many people, the 6P has a slightly smaller 5.7 inch screen in a body that's the same size as an iPhone 6S Plus. It comes in silver, black and the white version we have here and there's a choice of 32, 64 or 128 gig of storage. But like many new flagship Android phones, there's no micro SD slot for adding more. The 6P is the first all-metal Nexus and the CNC machined aluminium unibody feels light and strong. Compared to the Nexus 6, the 6P is much more manageable to hold with one hand and while it's not going to slip easily into a pocket, it's going to be a lot easier to live with. The AMOLED screen has a Quad HD resolution and it looks gorgeous with eye-popping colours and loads of detail. Around the back is a fingerprint scanner called the Nexus Inprint. This will come in handy for Google Pay as well as for unlocking the phone. We're not huge fans of the ugly black strip along the top and the rear, which houses the IR laser autofocus system and the 12 megapixel camera. This can shoot slow-mo video at 240 frames per second and there's also a burst mode which takes photos at 30 frames per second. At the front are stereo speakers which are surprisingly loud. Inside is the same Snapdragon processor as used by the OnePlus 2 along with Adreno 430 graphics and 3GB of RAM. The battery isn't removable but is charged via a reversible USB-C connector which supports fast charging. The 6P is one of the first phones to run Android Marshmallow and this is one advantage of buying a Nexus phone. You get plain Android and a pretty good guarantee of fast updates to future versions of Android. If you're a fan of big screen phones, the 6P is certainly going to appeal. It's well priced compared to Samsung's flagships at least, but will be a non-starter for anyone who wants expandable storage.